Hello, good evening, student. Good evening, teacher. How are good you? evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening. Hello. Okay, hello. How are you today, Wilfredo? Fine, teacher. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. Okay, students. Let me see. Okay, nice. Okay. okay, how are you, Lilian? Uh, I am fine. Thank you. Nice, good. Okay, Flor Leiva, how are you today? Fine, Peter. And you? I'm really good. Leticia, how are you? Fine, thank you, teacher. And you? Okay, really nice. Good. Okay, Sophie, how are you today? Mm, very good, teacher. Okay, nice. Remember that today is Monday. <laughs> okay. Okay. Nelly, how are you today? I'm fine, teacher. And you? Okay, really good. I'm fine. Thank you. Rebecca, how are you today? Hi, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. Okay, nice. I'm glad to hear that. Okay, students, um, we're going to start with today's class because of the time. And let's see, Stephanie, how are you today? Okay, Stephanie, how are you? Hi, how are you? I'm fine, very fine, thanks. Okay, that's good, amazing. Okay, students, uh, let's start with today's class. And we were waiting for Fabricio, remember, right? <laughs> okay, estamos esperando, Fabricio. Good evening, Fabricio. How are you today? She's so fine. Okay, nice. Okay, very good, the students. Uh, let's start with today's class. And let me see. We're going to start with, um, you know, this activity. Nos quedamos en esta actividad. Do you remember? Yep. Yes. Yeah, and we were, you know, giving directions about some places. For example, hospital, gas station, post office, and so on, right? Okay. Yes. Okay, very good. And we use these uh, questions when we ask for directions. All the time we're going to say the magic words, right? ¿Cuál es la palabra mágica? Excuse me. Excuse me. Can you help me? Can you help me? Yeah, Ricky. Why it is Can you important. help me? Yes, yeah. ¿Por qué es importante decir esto at the beginning of the conversation? Para ser respetuoso o amable. No hace algo. In order to be kind, Ricky. Sí, yeah. Cortesía. Cortesía, right? In this case, students, por cortesía y para ver si nos quieren ayudar, porque si nos dicen, no, 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 no. <laughs> no lo podemos no, no, no. Okay, let's give. Uh, then we have this question, is there, is there, ¿se, ¿se recuerdan qué significaba? Is there? Ay. Ay. Pero no de dolor, sino de que, a ver. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, very good. okay, in this case, is there a hospital around here? Around here? Alrededor de aquí. Hospital alrededor de acá o cerca de acá. Nice. And then, it is, yes, it is on the street, on the corner, right? Across from, across from, Next to, next, a la, a la between, en frente, uh, en medio, en medio, en medio, en medio, next to, what does it mean next to? A la par, a la par, a la par, de. a la par, 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 a la par,
Cruzando. Cruzando. Ajá, cruzando. Cruzando la calle. Cruzar, tal calle. Al cruzar. En la esquina de. Entre una calle y otra. Ok, ok. En la esquina de. En la esquina de. En la esquina de. En la esquina de. Sobre. 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 Okay, students. Uh, we're going to start with this activity, right? And I'm going to ask you, ¿Quién quiere que le pregunte? <laughs> okay. Okay, let's get Vamos a preguntarles a los más felices. Okay, let's get <laughs> Okay, very nice. Okay, let's see. Rebecca. Rebecca. Yes, teacher. Okay. Excuse me. Can you help me? Okay. Yes. <laughs> Very nice. Is there a, let's see, a gas station around here? Yes, it is um, between hospital. I know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Next to the hospital. Okay. <laughs> Next to or? Or across That's from true. parking? Yeah, very good. Across from, you know, the hospital because you have to cross, right? Ah, sí, verdad. Ah, yeah. Sorry. Very good. Thank you, Rebecca. Good work. Okay. Somebody else. Veamos. Eh, let me see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Excuse me, can you help me? Yes, sir. Okay, very good. Uh, is there a bank around here? Yes, it is uh, on Main Street. Yeah. Uh, Park Street. Okay. On the corner of the first avenue okay, okay, very good. Mm -hmm. yeah the bank right and also you can add between yeah between um, department store department store Maria's restaurant. restaurant restaurant very good good work okay uh Felicia really good work Felicia mentioned something really important, the street, the main street, and the avenue, really good. Okay, I don't know what to do. For example, if you ask me, I'm going to go there, I'm going to go there, I'm going to go there. That's good. Leticia. Yes, teacher. Okay, excuse me, can you help me? Yes, sir. Okay, is there a movie theater around here? Um, in front of uh, Pars Street. Okay, okay, very good. Uh, it's on uh, Main Street. Okay, very nice, good work. Okay, so then as you see, giving direction is really easy. You have to use these, um, you know, expressions on but all the time you're gonna say it is at the beginning. On, on the corner of, across from, next to, between, right? Okay, very good. Okay, continue with this. Basically today we're gonna continue with module number three and the topic for today's class will be to give directions. To give direction. Direcciones. Dar direcciones. Ok, very good. Vamos a aprender a dar direcciones. Ok, let's see at this. We have today's objectives. As you see, we are in section number 3, 3.0. Ok, we have the objective for today's class. Let's see. Somebody who helped me to read it. Who wants to read it? Me, teacher. Hi. Okay, okay. Well, let's see. Leticia. Leticia. B. Yeah. 
By the end of the class, you will read how to ask for and give direction. Additionally, you will practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is using, used in a real life setting. Okay, very good. Nice. Good work. Okay, for the second one. Four. Okay. Uh, by the end of this class, you will develop skills in reading for the tiles and making in inferences. Yes. Okay, nice. Okay, congratulations, students. You did it really good. Okay, basically, at uh, today's class, we will learn how to give direction, right? And also, we're going to develop a reading skill. Okay, we're going to see how to do this. We got some useful words for today's class, and we're going to start with this. How do you say this? Go up. Go up. Go up. Go up. And then walk up. Walk up. Walk up. Walk up. Walk up and go up. Go up. Do you have an idea about it? An idea? Hacia arriba. Camina hacia arriba. Ve arriba. Ok, ve arriba, camina hacia arriba. Estamos en Ok, muy bien. Ok, muy bien. Let's see, students. Uh, then we have go down. Go down. Go down. Walk down. What does walk it down. Walk down. Caminar hacia abajo o ir hacia abajo. Ir hacia abajo, caer abajo, ir así, ir así. O bajar. Yeah, o bajar. Very good, like this, right? Easy. Okay, continue with this. Then we have. Turn right on. Turn right on. Turn left on. Turn left on. Okay, turn right. Gira hacia la derecha o gira hacia la izquierda. Okay, turn right, turn right. Turn right, turn left. Turn right, turn left. Turn left. Turn left. Turn left. Turn left. We're going to add on, right? Turn right on, to left on. Okay. Uh, okay, very good. We have this one. On the right. On the right, on the left. Okay, very good. Sobre la derecha, sobre la izquierda. Okay, very nice. Good work. That's what we're going to do right now. Left and right. Right. Okay. Okay, very good. Left and right, students. Left and right. Derecha e izquierda. Muy bien. Izquierda. Okay, very good. Let's see. Okay. Does somebody have a question about this vocabulary? No question? No question. No question for this moment. Let's continue. We have a short conversation. What we're going to call it is far from here. Far from here. It's far from here. Yeah, very good. What does it mean far? Que están lejos. Lejos. Okay. Está lejos eso de aquí. Okay. Uh, as you say it first, como lo dijo de primera. ¿Qué tan lejos está? ¿Qué tan lejos está de aquí? Okay, very good. Okay, students, remember that all the time we're going to, uh, when we translate into Spanish, we're going to make a conversation. Right? Vamos a hacer una conversación. Uh, sometimes it means something. Uh, for example, uh, ¿Han notado que los títulos de algunas películas uh, en inglés dicen una cosa y en español dicen? Otra. 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 Distinta. Distinta. ¿Por qué? Esa es una compensation o adaptation. Adaptamos el mensaje para que se comprenda. ¿Sí? Así que en nuestro caso sería ¿Qué tan lejos está? De acá. Ok, very good. Ok, so basically we're going to practice this conversation. Somebody who help me to read it. Who wants to read it? I, 
Okay, Stephanie, somebody else? Wilfredo. <laughs> okay, Wilfredo, you will be tourist and El no, no, no. you will be woman, right? Okay, go ahead, Wilfredo. Excuse me, ma'am, can you help me? How do I get to state Patreon? Okay. Just walk up Fifth Avenue to 15th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And what is the Empire State Building? It's, it's, it's far. Uy, lo siento, lo siento. It's far from here? It's right behind behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay, very nice students. You did a really good work. Okay, congratulations. Nice pronunciation. Did it good. Okay, but now we're gonna see the previous vocabulary, right? I'm gonna start with this. Excuse me, is? Disculpa. Mom. Yeah, let's see. It's gonna sound like man, right? Man. Hi, madam. Okay. Yeah, very good, Leticia. Madam. Básicamente eh, es una con, contracción que hacemos. Contracción de madam. Ya, de madam. Este es solo man. Se pronuncia man. Y a veces decimos, este, what's up, man? No es ese, no es ese man. Este <risa> man. Es algo. <risa> ok, very good, madam. Eh, ok, for example, can you help me, madam? Or can you help me, madam? Man, man. Man, ma, más suave, man. Right. Man. Okay, very good. Okay, students, now, uh, can you help me? It's a basic. Yeah, very good. How do I get this? ¿Cómo puedo llegar a San Patrick Cathedral, la Catedral de San Patricio? Very good. Thank you, Stephanie. Just. Just. Solo. Ok, solo, pero no de, de solito, como estoy aquí. Ajá. Solamente. Okay, yeah, very good. Eh, ¿Solo? Camina, camina hacia camina arriba. Camina hacia ¿no? arriba en la quinta avenida. La quinta avenida. Y si, si no, toma la 50 la, la, calle. La 50 calle. A, las, a la calle 50. Ok, la a la 50. Eh, San Patricio San está, Patricio sobre, está sobre, la sobre la derecha. Okay, students. Now? Está cerca, cerca de, del centro Rockefeller. Near es cerca. Cerca. Near es cerca. Lejos. Okay, that's good. Okay. Yes. What does it mean this? Yes. Yes. Right. Rockefeller Center. Está a la derecha. De Rockefeller Center. Cruzando. Cruzando. Está a la derecha. Cruzando. Desde Rockefeller Center. Thank you. Thank you. Gracias. Gracias. ¿En dónde está el Empire State Building? ¿Y dónde está el edificio del Empire State? Sí, muy bien. Está lejos de acá. Está a la derecha. Sí, a la derecha, atrás tuyo. Yeah, very good. It's right behind. Behind. Está atrás de ti. Detrás. Very good. Solamente, solamente gira alrededor y lo verás. Yeah, yeah very good. Okay, nice. Congratulations. Now that you understand this conversation, we're going to practice again. 
who wants to do it? Who wants to practice this conversation? Okay. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you, Flora. Somebody else? Fabricio. Yeah. Ah, Fabricio. Very good, Fabricio. Okay. Okay. Qué <laughs> mala, Leticia. Practice. Practice. Fabricio, you will be tourist and uh, tourist. will be welcome, right? Okay, go ahead. Okay. okay. Excuse me, mom. Can you help me? How do we, how do I get to St. Patrick Cathedral? Just go walk up Fifth Avenue and um, Fifth Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it is right across from Rockefeller Center. Okay. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is that far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay, very nice. Good work, Fabricio and Flora. Okay, thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Good work. Okay, students, uh, somebody else? The last couple. Fabricio, choose one of your classmates. Yeah, but we call Leticia. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Leticia. Okay, Leticia. Uh, Flor, can you choose one of your classmates, please? Yep. La venganza es mala, Fabricio. Y que no sé qué otro. Usted de venir del favor. <laughs> Okay, okay. Para que practiques. Eh, a Sof, puede ser una mujer, puede ser Sofi. Yeah, sure, sure. Sofi, okay, Sofi. Sofi, Sofi. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. Leticia, you will be tourist, and Sofi will be women, right? Go ahead. One, two, three. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do you get? Uh, how do you get to his street, Patrick Cutler? Uh, as well, uh, Fifth Avenue, to Fifth uh, Street, uh, Patrick is on the right. Okay. The Rockefeller Center? Yes, it is right across from uh, Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is and the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It, it is right uh, be, behind. behind behind you. You turn uh, around and look up. Okay, very nice. Thank you. Good job. Okay, Leticia and Sophie, thank you so much. Very good. Okay, students, basically this conversation is really easy for you, right? Because you know already how to give directions. That's amazing. Okay, continue with today's class. And we got madam, right? Madam. And the contraction is man. 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 Yeah, man. Yeah, that's formal, right? When we referring to a lady that we don't know if she's married or single, right? Okay, very good. Okay, there we go. Okay, students, and then we have this that you can find on the platform. We have a video and we have this. How do I get to, how do I get to, right? How do you, how do you get to? How yeah. do you? How could you get to? Okay. How do you get to? How do I get to? What does how, it mean? How do you? Do I get to? How do I get to? Okay. Okay. Very good. Did you remember that uh, we were talking about is there? Yeah. Where, then the place. 
and is it far or near, you know, or around here? But now we are gonna use, how do I get to? How do I get to? Como? Como hago para llegar, para llegar ahí. Okay. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo llego a este lugar? Y decimos el lugar. Uh -huh. La palabra clave sería how do I get to? Ok, repeat, please. How do I get to? How, how do, do I get, I get to? to? Ok, ok, very good. Remember, students, that when we have this, if we want to sound, um, you know, natural, Cuando tengamos este tú, dijimos que cuando lo decíamos rápido, eh, íbamos a ponerlo como una R, right? How do I get to? 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 Yeah, very good. For example, how do I get to the park? How do I get to the hospital? How do I get to the park? How do I get? How do I get? How do I get? Yeah, like this. Okay, nice. Then we have uh, almost the same questions, right? But now we have something different. It is can. Can. Okay. What is can? I get to Bar. Okay. How can I get to? How can how I can get to? How can I get to? How can I get to? How can I get to the park? How can I get to the terminal? How can I get to the library and so on, right? Okay. In my advice, students, quédense con la que es más fácil de decir. Y es más fácil para ustedes decir how can I get to? How do 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 I get to? And remember that you can also use uh, there is, there are. Is there, are there? And we talk about plural places, right? Okay. A possible answer that you can use walk up. Or go up is the same, es lo mismo. And the street, right? Or the avenue, Fifth Avenue. Okay, Fifth Avenue, right? Okay, the other center. Okay, turn left. Turn left. On um, 49th Street. On 49th Street. Turn left on 49th Street. Yes, it is on the right. It is on the right. Yeah, it is on the right. This building, right? Okay, very good. Then we have the second question. How can I get to Bryant Park? I gotta get to Bryant Park. Okay, well done, go down the same. Well done, go down. Well down, go down. Fifth Avenue. Fifth Avenue. Yeah, very good. Then what we're gonna do? Turn right. Turn right on second or two. Right on street. Forty second street. Turn right. It's on the left. It's on the left. It's on the left. It's on the left. Very good, nice. Okay, students, eh, in this uh, middle class, eh, a veces vamos a ver la cámara un poco al revés. Si digo derecha, se va a ver a la izquierda, so right. Así que vamos a practicar like this. Pero you, uh, you know already that right is derecha and left is izquierda. Right. Left, right, okay. Right, left. Right, and left. Right, okay. right, left. Okay, students. Um, okay, before to practice today's activity, we're gonna watch the video, right, for today's class. And we have this. Give me a minute. 
Yeah, okay. Here we go. Okay, students. Uh, you can see my screen. Yep. Yeah, bring it. There we go. Okay, we are on section three. No, <laughs> yeah. Okay, reading the World Cup. Okay, students, we have this. Okay, remember that you have to complete the knowledge check all the time. Okay, first we're gonna see this. Okay, students. Avenue or go up, Matt. Escuchen el video? Yep. Sí, sí. Yeah, okay, very good. Here we go, students. Okay, go ahead. In this class, you'll learn how to ask for and give directions. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled, Is it far from here? Let's listen and practice. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? How do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk up 5th Avenue to 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. We're going to practice giving directions now. Let's practice these phrases and vocabulary to give directions. How do I get to Rockefeller Center? Walk up Fifth Avenue. Go up Fifth Avenue. Turn left on 49th Street. It's on the right. Okay, students, uh, basically, as you see, we were talking about the two questions you can ask for giving directions. And how do you, how do you get to, how can you get to, right? Okay, uh, continue with the video, right? Okay. Ah, ¿escucharon cómo se decía catedral? Yes, cathedral. Cathedral. Yeah, very nice, good word. Okay, continue with this. How can I get to Bryant Park? Walk down Fifth Avenue. Go down Fifth Avenue. Turn right on 42nd Street. It's on the left. So, let me summarize the vocabulary we must learn. Four questions. How do I get to? And we mention a place. Or, how can I get to? Then we mention a place. Four answers. Walk up. Go up. Walk down. Go down. Turn left on. Turn right on. On the right on the left. Make sure you memorize this vocabulary as it will be essential to ask for and give directions. Now let's try to analyze the expressions walk up or go up. The first thing we want to do when giving directions is to have a departing point. Where are you located and where do you want to go? Let's say that we are at the Empire State Building and we have a question like the example shows. How do I get to Rockefeller Center or how can I get to Rockefeller Center? The first instruction would be walk up Fifth Avenue or go up Fifth Avenue. Now let's pretend that we are at 42nd Street and Madison Avenue. And we want to get to St. Patrick's Cathedral. The question would be, how do I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Or how can I get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? 
The first instruction would be walk up Madison Avenue or go up Madison Avenue. Now, let's pretend we are at St. Patrick's Cathedral and we want to get to New York Public Library. The question would be, how do I get to New York Public Library? Or, how can I get to New York Public Library? The first instruction would be, walk down Fifth Avenue or go down Fifth Avenue. So what is the next step to get to New York Public Library? For that, we will use the vocabulary, turn right on or turn left on, depending on where our destination is. So to answer that question, we will say, turn right on 42nd Street. So what is the last step after turning right on 42nd Street? For that, we will use the vocabulary on the right or on the left. So in this case, it's on the left. Now it's your turn to practice. I would like for you to give directions using this map. Also, try to give directions to your local supermarket, hospital, school, park, etc. Hi, everyone. Okay, very good, nice. Okay, students, basically, uh, give direction the simple, as you see, right? You can use, is there? Or, how, how do I get to? How can I get to? And you have to add the place, right? Okay, students, let's see. I don't know if you have a question. No questions? No questions. Everything is clear? Yeah, very nice. <laughs> you <just> look sleepy. <laughs> okay, that's good, nice. Okay, if you don't have questions, I have a question for you guys. Let's see. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay, we have some questions for directions when we give in directions and let's analyze this. Okay, let me see. Okay, that's good. Okay, students, the first question that we have is, is there a, and we, you know, at the place, and then around here. Esta fue la primera que aprendimos, right? The last week. Okay, very nice. Then we have, how do I get to the park? And how can I get to the Grand Central Terminal, right? Basically, it's the same, but uh, the difference is do or can. ¿Cómo llego a tal lugar? ¿O cómo puedo llegar a tal lugar? Ahí, eh, ustedes, you can, uh, you are allowed to do whatever you want. Pueden usar la que ustedes más les parezca bien, right? And possible answer, it is. All the time, you're going to say it is or it. Because we are talking about place, right? Okay, on the corner, yep, across from, next to, next to, next to, very good, between, entre, yeah, very good, on the right, la derecha, on the left, la izquierda, very good. Okay, students, uh, just, you can use just, too, just. Yep, what does it mean, just? Solamente. Solo, solo, justo, tal cosa, right? Okay, very good. Go up, walk up, walk up is the same. Go down, walk down, right? And so, esto ya lo vimos, así que, let's see here. Uh, you can use also this if you want to, you know, make an emphasis when you are giving or asking for directions. Is it far from here? The place, right? You can add the place. Está lejos de aquí. Pueden agregar el lugar si ustedes desean. Oh, is it near from here? And you add the place, right? Yep. 
Everything is clear? Yeah, more or less, good. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, students, uh, I know that this topic is, you know, a little boring. I, you look like this. <laughs> but, right. you know, when we are learning, uh, we're going to find some uh, difficult or tedious topic, but it's really important to, you know, to practice. It's normal because of the time. Uh, we are a little tired. I imagine you work during the whole day and then you start. But if you are here, students, uh, you know, get for granted and we're going to do our best. Vamos a hacer lo mejor que se pueda. That's why I bring it to you a little game, right? Por eso les traje un pequeño jueguito, así que let's practice this, right? Okay, students, let's see. We have... Uh, these um, maps right here and what we're gonna do here we have to build these questions and we have to answer how to get to park how do I get to the building state how do I get to the library how do I get to Rockefeller Center and so on right etc okay and we have to give the right answer. For example, uh, let me see, we have an example. Imagine that we have this little man here, right? And Stephanie Rosales asked me this question. Go ahead. La misma pregunta otro, otro lugar. This one, la misma. Okay. How do I get to Empire State World in? Okay, very good. Okay, um, you know, just walk up and just turn left. It is in front of you, right? Like this, right? It is in front of you. Notaron? Estaba bien. Esa es la más difícil, básicamente. Aquí la dirección más difícil, right? Eh, <laughs> Estaba acá y lo hicimos que se moviera hasta aquí. Muy bien. That's good. Amazing. Ok, students. Eh, voy a seleccionar yo el, 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 el place. And you have to ask the questions. And vamos a elegir a alguien que la responda. Ready? Ready. Ok, ok. Very good. Nice. Let me see. Stephanie Rosales. Can you choose one of your classmates? Mm, a Wilfredo. Wilfredo, ok, Wilfredo. <laughs> okay. ok, Wilfredo, eh, let me see. Ok, this one, Wilfredo. How do I get to New York Public Library? Ok, very good. Uh, choose one of your classmates who who wants to answer your questions? Come on, teacher. Elija uno de sus compañeros para que le responda. Ok. Este... Fabricio. Ok, Fabricio. What would Fredo need to do to go at this? Estoy parado donde? Yeah, this. I am. Okay. Yeah, by the state. Uh huh. By the state. Walk out. Walk, walk out and. Yes. The Peter Simon you. Okay, okay. Very good. Yeah. Uh, Very nice. Yeah, uh, left. Left. No, sorry. Turn left. Okay. Turn left. Oh. Turn left on 42nd Street. Okay, very good. And that's it. Congratulations. Good work. Okay, students. Amazing, right? Okay, very good. Wilfredo and Fabricio. Okay, Fabricio, can you choose one of your classmates? Uh. Yes. Yeah, let you. <laughs> Don't be nervous, Leticia. 
Es una democracia. Democracia. Es el de democracia. Democracia. Leti. Ah, Leti. Ok, ok, let's get Leti. Así. Yeah, very nice. Uh, ok. Ask, ask these questions. Ah, ok. Brian Park, sí. Yeah. How, how I do get to Brian Park? Ok. 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 Answer that Estoy question. In the public library, ¿verdad? Yeah. Um, walk up and just uh, turn left. Ok, very good. The 6th Avenue. Ok, very nice. Congratulations. Did a good job, Leticia. Really good. Nice. Ok, now uh, Leticia. Uh, choose one of your classmates. Sophie. Okay, Sophie, very good. Sophie, uh, Leticia, ask yeah. this one. Okay. Okay, Sophie, how do you get to yeah. the Federal Center? Okay, Sophie. Okay, um, uh, walk up and use um, uh, turn no no uh, <laughs> in front of in front it is um Fifth Avenue from I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what well, um, Sixth Avenue, Rockefeller Center. It's on the right. It's on. Yeah, okay, it's on the right. Right, right. <laughs> okay, <laughs> Okay, okay, that's good. So, <laughs> very good. Uh, A mí me perdió porque yo pregunté. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, Sophie, uh, you have to choose one of your classmates. Um, Elsie. Okay, Elsie, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, very good. Thank you. Okay, uh, Sophie, you have to ask for else, you know, this, this one. What? This one. Patrick. Patrick Brown. Yeah. Patrick Cathedral? Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, Questions. How do you? How do do get to uh? Is we don't Patrick Patrick got one. Yeah, very good. Thank you, Sophie. Okay, answer, Elsie. Um, what up and just yeah. Um, um, I'll turn left. Very good. Is um, from you. Oh. Yeah, very nice. Congratulations, okay. Elsie. Okay. You did a good. Nice. Thanks. Thanks. Okay, very nice. Okay, Elsie, choose one of your classmates, please. Um, Rebecca. Okay, Rebecca, you are a lucky lady, right? Okay, nice. Okay, Elsie, ask uh, how do you, how do you, how do you get to this? Okay, how do you get to Grand Central Terminal? Okay, Rebecca. Um, walk, walk down and. Okay, very good. What else? 
and just turn right, okay. turn left or right. <laughs> Okay. No sé para dónde va el muñequito. <laughs> okay, really good. Okay, walk down, right? Then turn right or left? Right. Okay, very good. Then, then Madison Avenue. Okay, very good. Yeah, nice. Then. And it is front of you. Okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, very good. It is in front of, of you, right? You have to turn, you know, right again and Grand Central Terminal is in front of you. Very good work, Rebecca and Elsie. Good work. Okay, congratulations, you did it good. Nice. Okay, thank you, students. Okay. Basically, students, we were talking about two questions, right? How do I get to the park? How do I get to the bank? And how can I get to, I don't know, you have to add a place, right? And the way that you have to answer these questions. Okay, really good. Nice, continue with this. Let me see. Okay. And then the little boy lost, right? Okay, very good. Okay, students, now we have a reading. We have a reading time. Yeah. Okay. Um, because of the time, voy a seleccionarlo yo <laughs> por el tiempo. Así que vamos a empezar con Fabiola. Fabiola, can you help me to read the first one, please? Okay. Start your tour on the Empire State Building, the Fifth Avenue. Okay. Okay, thirty third. Can you repeat? Okay, thirty third. Third. Thirty third. Thirty. We're third in 34th Street. Yeah. The building has 102 floors. Take the, take the elevator to the 102, 102nd floor to a great view of New York City. Okay, very nice. Thank you, Fabiola. Really good work. Okay, number two. Yeah, let me see. Stephanie Rosales. Are you there, Stephanie? Yes, yes, I'm here. Yeah, yeah, okay. Don't be shy, please. Go ahead. I'm here. I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> uh, what number? Number two. Number two. Now walk up Fifth Avenue, seven blocks to the New York Public Library, Library. The entrance is between 40th and 42nd Street. This library holds over 10 million book, books. Behind the library is Bryant, Bryant Park. In the summer, there's an outdoor cafe. And at lunch hour, there are free music concerts. Okay, very nice. Good work, Stephanie Rosales. Congratulations. Nice pronunciation, too. Okay, very good. <laughs> Great. Yes, uh, ladies, let me see. Um, Sophie, number three. Okay. What up? Sit Avenue to uh, 49 Street. You are standing in the middle of the United Building of uh, Rockefeller Center. Yeah. To right on uh, 49 uh, Street, walk another block and turn left. You are in Rockefeller Plaza. In the 
when 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 uh, you can you can I you can I skate in the right there. Okay, very good. Nice, good work, students. Okay, Sophie, thank you. Okay, this one, this word you have to say middle, middle. 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 Okay, very good. Middle. Este es a la, como a la mitad. Muy bien, very good. Then we have this. Let me see. Yeah. Winter. 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 Rink. 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 Yeah, rink is como la pista de patinar. La pista, right? Oh, okay. Okay, thank you, Sophie. Really good. Okay, and we're gonna finish with number four. And let me see, ladies, Rebecca. Okay, go ahead, Rebecca. Sí, right across from Rockefeller Center on 5th Avenue is St. Patrick Cathedral. It's modeled after the cathedral in Cologne, Germany. Yeah. Go inside St. Patrick and leave the noisy city behind. Look at the beautiful blue window. Many of the window, these windows come from frames. Okay, very nice students. Really good work. Okay, congratulations. Thank you. Uh, that's a nice work, students. Today you are improving a lot when you read. That's amazing. And remember that all the time to complete the check knowledge or knowledge check, right? And at the end, you have to complete uh, the midterm exam too. Tiene que hacer el, el examen que está ahí, el midterm. Terminenlo, son como cinco partes sumamente hermosas. I really like it. <laughs> okay. Uh, if you have a question, students, you can ask me through WhatsApp and I can help you right on the platform. Yep. Okay. I don't know if you have any questions. No question. No question. Everything is clear. No question, teacher. Everything is clear. Okay. Okay, nice. Very good. Basically, uh, we were discussing about how to give direction. Is there? How can I get to? How do I get to? And how to answer, right? Like cross, from, next to, between, on, on the corner, and so on. On the right, on the left, and many other ways to give directions. Okay, students, that's it for today's class. Unfortunately, time is over, but thanks for being here and have a really nice day. Go to sleep and see you tomorrow, right? See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. Good night. 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 Good night.